In this video, I'll be showing how to get all of the new items in the Roblox Islands Fishing Festival event, so make sure to subscribe with the notifications on for more Islands videos and like the video. First, you're going to need to go to the Fishing Festival, so you can do this either by clicking the button on the side right here that has a picture of a fish and says Festival, or you can go over to the main island, and where the sign was, there is now a portal that says Fishing Festival by it, so just go through that portal. The first item is Shipwreck Podium, gift from Talia at a Fishing Festival. So right when you spawn, you're gonna see Talia here. Just talk to Talia, she's gonna ask you about your animals. Just say good, I think that was the option, and then once you say that, then she's gonna be like, here I have a gift for you then you're gonna get the shipwreck podium. The only other items you can get are by doing things in the fishing contest, which you have to catch fish, and I suggest using an iron fishing rod and bait if you wanna get good fish, but it doesn't really matter since it's just based on catches, not how good the fish are that you get. The best way to fish is from experience, so the longer you fish, the more you're probably going to get the fishing rod on the fish, so just try to go to where the most fish are, but where there are not that many people. So like there are two people right there, but there are four fish, so I think this is a decent spot. So just try to land the fishing rod on the fish, and try to catch as many fish as you possibly can. If you go over to the fishing guy at spawn, he explains a few things. Like, Thomas, he says that he's hosting a contest to find the best fishermen in town. Each contest lasts 15 minutes, whoever catches the most fish wins sea tickets. And then my buddy Oscar will trade your sea tickets for some rare items. What he doesn't tell you is it's a little broken. Like, it says four minutes left, but it also says the top people only have three catches. But the top people definitely have way more than that. Also, the leaderboard is random. Like, when I was in the server earlier, it said, it, like, the top person was eight, then the bottom was 16. It didn't even show the top three. Also, even though it's supposed to last 15 minutes, for some reason it resets like every five minutes, and then at the end of the third five minutes, so then it gives you the tickets. So I don't know why it keeps resetting, and the leaderboard is a little broken, but it'll probably be fixed soon. For first place, I'm pretty sure you get 10 tickets, and then for second place, I think you get six. Third place is four, and then if you get lower, I think it goes down a bit more. Even though they removed quests for all of the NPCs, they still say their level by their name for some reason. But if you go over to the redeem tickets guy, then he says the fish banner is 14 tickets, so that's actually kinda easy to get. So if you're first place, then third place, you can afford it, so that's about 30 minutes of fishing. Right now it's way easier to get, because the fisherman said it's supposed to be 15 minutes, but it's actually 5 minutes for right now. So maybe they accidentally wrote 15 and it's supposed to be 5, I don't know, but one of them is wrong. The tidal aquarium is 64 tickets, so if it's supposed to be 15 minutes, you're gonna have to be first place at least 7 times to get this, because you're gonna have 70 tickets, so you'll have a little bit left over. But that is going to be like an hour 45 minutes of being first place, so that is going to take a long time. Yeah, the fishing contest just reset and it says 5 minutes instead of 15 again. Well, if it's supposed to be 5 minutes, then that's only 35 minutes of being first place. Then there's the fish festival trophy, which you need to be first place 45 times to get, or you can be lower places, but it's going to take significantly longer. With it being 15 minutes, it will take 11 hours 15 minutes to get the fish festival trophy, but if it's only supposed to be 5 minutes per round, then that's going to take 3 hours 45 minutes. Again, that's with being first place every time, so if you're not first place, that's probably going to take you at least like... 12 hours to do if it's just five minutes if it's supposed to be 15 that's gonna probably be like two days of fishing and i'm pretty sure the fishing festival lasts until monday make sure you're in a larger server though because the less people the less tickets so number one was supposed to be 10 like i mentioned earlier i think 10 is the max but in this smaller server, since there was only seven people, the top person got four, but the person in second place also got four tickets, which that doesn't really make sense. Why would the person in first place and the person in second place get the same amount? With constantly having to make sure you're in larger servers, I'm pretty sure that this would take a long time to get. It's definitely going to be very hard to get the fish trophy. If you wanted to try to AFK farm tickets, I guess you could. Like, you could start recording a macro, have it throw the fishing line, out, have it wait for a few seconds, then have it click so that if there's a fish there then you get it. But the timing would definitely be off, so you would probably not get a fish most of the time, every now and then you would though. 
The reason why that's important is when you have zero catches, I'm pretty sure you get zero tickets because for a few rounds I had no catches at all while I was recording this video. I didn't get any tickets from those, so you need to catch at least one of fish because when I caught one of fish earlier in the video, I got two tickets for that round. But you'll probably get at least one fish from doing that though. Still not sure if it's supposed to be 5 or 15 minutes because the fishing contest says 5 but the fisherman says 15. So after a while, you'll get a decent amount of tickets, since it will probably take around 4 hours to get it if you're first place every time, and that's considering if you get 10 tickets. That's maybe gonna be 1 fifth, so it's gonna take 5 times longer. So if you do that for the entire day, then you might be able to get the fishing trophy. Considering it would probably take around 4 hours to get the fishing trophy if you got 10 tickets every round, which means you would need to be first place and be in a large server, it will probably take around 20 hours if you do the AFK farm thing, because like you'd get 2 tickets every round. That's with it being 5 minutes per round, so it would take 3 times longer, which means it would be impossible, because if this lasts for 2 days, then you would need more than 48 hours. It's definitely a good idea to trade these items though because the shipwreck podium people only need to make an alt to get it then they can sell it and people do that with the berry seeds already and they're worth around 6,000 coins so people will probably sell this for 10,000 coins then the fish banner is pretty easy to get so I'm gonna try to buy them both for 10,000 coins but then I'm gonna try selling them for maybe like way more I don't know I'll put them on my value list whenever like probably it's tomorrow, then I'll do a video on the values of all of these items, like in the chickens update, and then all of the items in the fishing event. That's how to get all of the items. I'm probably gonna test the AFK farm later and see if you can even do that, because that's why I said probably earlier, because I'm not 100% sure if it's gonna completely work out. But it may be really good. I'm definitely going to try to get the trophy though. Because again, if we do have two days to do this, we're going to have to fish a lot. Again, I'm not 100% sure it's going to end then and everything can change. So it doesn't say anywhere when the fishing festival is going to end, I think. But I'll let you know in the description. Like if I figure it out, I'll put that in the description. But still, it seems like it's ending in two days because that's what one of my friends told me. I was originally going to do a separate video for how to get the thing from Talia, but then I realized that would probably be like one minute long, maybe two minutes long, but it would be super short. Also, this is going to be like the only event that won't have a whole bunch of duped items. Like the Witch Trophy was duped a whole bunch, Snow Globes were duped a whole bunch. But since the dupes were fixed and everything was removed, the Fishing Trophy is actually going to be pretty rare. To keep you up to date with the build battle, I'm probably still doing it next Saturday because I'm not busy then so far, and also I think I'll get enough coins by then because I have 750 million right now, and if I trade for the rest of the week I'll probably get like 1 billion or 1.1 billion. Also I'm planning for the build battle to be very big, like it's probably gonna take 8 hours, maybe 12 hours to do. Also I don't really know what's going on with animals right now, like my cow is up here, two of my chickens are up here, I don't know why they keep like spawning up on the top floor, they should really fix that. I have already been sold two shipwreck podiums and let's check the fish banners four fish banners well i already had one in so i actually got sold three but like that is pretty good and i can probably sell them for a lot more so these are really nice for trading i'm gonna trade a lot today but that's gonna be it for this video so make sure to subscribe with the notifications on for more islands videos like the video join the discord server linked in the description follow my twitter at talanthric use star code talanthric to support my channel and links in the description is a guide called Roblox Islands Guide that has all my helpful islands videos on it. So if you need help with anything, then check that out because it's probably there. But I'll see you all in the next video.